just got back from spending the afternoon outside. I am quite sweaty at this point. So as you can see, gotten a little bit of, as people like to call nowadays, mask knee. Still don't know how I feel about that term. But because we are wearing face masks all the time, which is, you know, close to our skin, it's causing extra sweat, which can potentially clog pores cause acne and you know in addition to another host of factors things like your diet um, stress levels where you are in your like cycle like your menstrual cycle that could also affect it but having a mask up close to your face all day <laughs> probably doesn't help very much so here is what I do after I get home after wearing my face my face mask all day this is the one that I wear first thing I do when I come home is actually wash my hands. So I'm gonna do that real quick. Don't forget to get in between the fingers underneath the nails. All clean. Another thing I like to do when I get home is um, wash my face mask by hand. I'm just gonna use regular soap and water for this. Just regular bar soap. is clean now. I'm just gonna wring it out and hang it to dry. On to the goods. First thing is I'll just quick wash my face. Right now I'm using this bar soap uh, from Dome. I'll tag them below uh, but this is just a regular face and body soap bar. I feel like I'm in one of those Vogue videos where you know like the people go through their whole beauty routine in the morning, but I don't have a beauty routine <laughs> Just make sure not to scrub too hard, but you know Gently but sufficiently scrub your face and then I just wash with cold water Next steps when I am treating acne specifically, like here or here, I will use a turmeric acne face mask that I got from Bestowed Essentials. Where is it? Here it is. Here's what it looks like. I'll take a little bit and get some on my finger, like scrub, 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 and just kinda spot treat. I also have a little bit of scarring down on my chin. This treatment I'm supposed to leave on for, oh, it says for at least 20 minutes, um, and it does stain. So once you do uh, wipe your face from it, make sure you're using a cloth that you don't love. So like I said, this will stay on for at least 20 minutes. So in the meantime, you know, don't touch your face, just kind of like let it do its thing. And then I'll be back in 20 minutes to Proceed. Here I am like an hour after I did the mask or the acne treatment and I just wanted to show you a little bit up close. I feel like it's already going down a little bit. The camera is not always as good as like in real life, but it does seem to be like a little more calm than it was before I tried this acne treatment. I'll just keep kind of doing this as long as I have this quote unquote mask me or whatever. I feel like that's kind of cringy. Let's figure out another word for it so we don't have to keep saying that. Uh, I'll report back the next couple of days, show you how it works. One thing I will say, I haven't used any moisturizer since like the summer really started because it's like too hot. <laughs> My face already produces enough oil, but normally in my normal chillier weather skincare routine, I'll implement a moisturizer. Quick face update. So I uh, woke up a couple hours ago and I'm about to head out again for to drop off my compost today. So just wanted to do a very quick showing of how my face looks the next morning after I do that acne treatment. Actually, it's gone down a lot and like it's kind of flattened as well. I think it looks a little bit better 
it definitely in real life looks better um but like i said i'm about to go on a long walk again in which i will wear my face mask for the entire time so might do another round of what i did yesterday uh depending on how i'm feeling maybe i'll do like a full face mask but um yeah i just got back from my morning out uh and i just washed my hands so let's see the damage <sighs> wow so much face sweat first i'm gonna just like wipe my face with a little cold water. The initial sweat is gone, so I'm gonna wash my face mask. This is actually a, a different face mask. Uh, they're both the same design as they're from the same company, but um, I am just gonna do the same thing that I did yesterday, wash my hand. Okay, so once again, I'm just gonna wash my face. I don't think I'm gonna do another one of the acne treatments because it really doesn't look that bad. I'm gonna not do it for now and then we'll like kind of see how the rest of the day goes. I'm still gonna work out at some point at home. Uh, so we'll kind of check in then and see like when I wash my face again after my workout if I feel it needs a little extra TLC or if I can kind of just get away with this. So just gonna wash my face again and see how it goes. All right, here's how my face looks. Still a little bit, you know, imperfect, but you know what? Life gives us pimples and you know what? It's okay. It's just natural, we're humans. I'm gonna try to cool off a little bit, do, um, then do like a quick workout and then, yeah, I guess I'll check in later. All right, y'all, this is gonna be my last little clip for this video because honestly, like it has gone down so much. It's nearly like fully flat. I haven't like really touched it or picked at it or anything at all. By tomorrow morning, I'm almost certain it will be like a blip, just a memory. In conclusion, there are zero waste products out there to help you with your skin. With that being said, not every skin product works with every skin type and you know your skin depends on your jeans jeans not the ones you wear you know g-e-n-e-s that one my dad would have laughed at that one it depends on your jeans your stress level where you are in your cycle so we're all human we all get acne sometimes it's okay it's normal it's natural it doesn't make us a bad person it doesn't mean we're dirty it doesn't mean we you know aren't taking care of ourselves it's just how our skin reacts so Keep that in mind hope you all enjoyed this video if you have some zero waste like acne specific products that you use on your skin let me know in the comments also please comment your recommendations for terminology aside from mask me which is really just every time i say that i feel like oh i hate myself a little bit more i'll keep saying it until somebody gives me a better recommendation so I'm depending on you guys. But anyways, thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.